Yesterday it was announced that Daredevil is now cancelled and won't be renewed for a fourth season. Poor Daredevil. He never saw it coming. So that makes it the third Marvel Netflix TV show that's been cancelled along with Iron Fist and Luke Cage. So I guess a Defender Season 2 is definitely out the window now. So obviously this is a move to get these Marvel licensed TV shows off of the off of the Netflix platform so that Disney can later on put it on their Disney streaming service that they're releasing at some point I'm not sure when which confuses me a bit because these TV shows if you have watched them I'm going to assume that you have they are very violent and have a dark tone. That leaves Jessica Jones and The Punisher as the only two that are left and that are still going on Netflix. Jessica Jones has season three coming out next year and The Punisher has season two coming out next year. I think that we all know that they're going to get cancelled shortly after their latest seasons get released next year and with all the other shows they'll get put on the Disney streaming service. And a Netflix spokesperson has said, we're thankful for showrunner Eric Olsen, the show's writers, stellar crew, and an incredible cast, including Charlie Cox as Daredevil himself. And we're grateful to the fans who have supported the show over the years. No worries. While the series on Netflix has ended, the three remaining seasons will remain on the service for years to come while the Daredevil character will live on in future projects for Marvel. So from this article, we know that Daredevil, all three seasons will remain on Netflix for at least a few more years to come. I assume that's going to be the same for the other shows as well, that they'll stay on Netflix for a few more years and then they'll just be solely found on the Disney streaming service. And then eventually when they are taken off Netflix, we're going to have no choice but to... to, to subscribe to the Disney streaming service to be able to watch those shows. Also in the article it says the Daredevil character. I'm not sure if they're referring, if they mean this particular iteration of the devil, Daredevil that's been in the Netflix series or if they're going to introduce a new one or re completely redo it in a more kid-friendly way. I'm not sure. It's, I'm not sure how to how to read when they just say the Daredevil character. They don't particularly say the Netflix Daredevil character, but I might be reading into it too much. Let me know what you think in the comments if you think they're going to completely redo him or if they're going to keep this Netflix character. It also says that he will be seen in future projects. That could mean that he could be introduced into the Marvel Cinematic Universe, the movies, or into another Marvel TV show, or they might make a completely different adaptation that might be made solely for the Disney, Disney streaming service. So of course I'm not happy about it being cancelled. Daredevil is the best MCU show on Netflix, and now it's gone. Season, two, season one was fantastic. Season two was okay for me. Season three was really good. Those are just my thoughts on Daredevil getting cancelled. As always, thank you for watching and I'll catch you next time.